Hi, Charles here from Southern Indiana. Well, in my last very exciting video, you saw me put some underglow lighting under the van from Nylite. Uh, they supplied me with one of the kits. And then I also added some up there just for fun mainly. Today, I'm going to show you something again from Nylite that they did send me. And this one involves safety as well. Thanks for watching. Well, summer is gone. It'll be October in a few days. And uh, not tonight, but the next three nights, we'll be camping at Hardy Lake with um, other campers from our church, Elevation Church Ministries in Scottsburg. So we're looking forward to that. It'll be a little cool at night, but uh, we'll be just fine in here. Today I just want to show you nothing new, but um, I'm glad to have it. I worked with Nylite before in our van build with some lights and switches that I got from them. And so they liked what I did about the underglow lighting. And they're actually sending me an extra kit that I'm going to put on a runaway camper. Uh, uh, someone from in Indianapolis is coming down. And so they supplied me with that. So I'm going to get them lit up underneath for fun. And Nylite said, do you see anything else in our catalog? And I, at first I said, I really don't see anything else I need. And then I thought, you know, I, maybe having an emergency light would be nice because uh, we rarely drive at night, but if we do, if we have to pull over, whether we're on an interstate or a country road or whatever, uh, I'd like to not get murdered by some other cars. I could hit the, the red triangle and turn the flashing lights on, and that's probably good enough. But then I thought having one of these strobe lights might be really good as well. And so uh, they asked me which color, and I said, well, I want the amber. They actually sell a red and blue and a blue version. And uh, it would not be good in Indiana to have the red and blue because that's, that's for police. So if you were on the side of the road with that going with red and blue and they came up, they, might, they would frown on that. And then the blue light is typically used by volunteer firemen. I have a son-in-law and his dad are volunteer firemen, so they throw one of those up. So I chose the amber. And um, this has uh, magnets underneath, but it's got this cover, uh, rubber cover, just to protect your paint. And so it's really strong, so you can put it anywhere and it's going to stay. I have no intention of putting this up while, and use it while driving. I don't need that. I would just put this on the side or the top. It just depends on the situation. And while I'm talking, I'm showing you just some of the patterns that it does, but it's crazy bright. It even warns you this can cause eye damage if you really stare into it. It's super bright, and you can't control that brightness. It's just bright, and I think it's got 16 different patterns, so as I'm talking, I'll show you some of those patterns. Some of them could probably start a seizure, so I would just go with just some strobe on and off um, if I was in a situation where I needed it. You power it just like you would an air compressor with a 12-volt plug, and it's got an on and off switch, and then it has a momentary switch that you can keep pushing to switch to, to the different modes. And um, so in most situations, this cord would be long enough, but I always think it's a great idea to, to carry one of these extensions. This is a really nice long extension, and I can use it for this. What I wanted it for is for my air compressor, because to, if I was plugging in from up there, I, it won't reach all the way to the back tire. So this is just handy to have, and, and in my last video I said I could use this to run power up to the top to turn on those lights up there since I didn't think ahead enough to have run some extra wires up there. So anyway, uh, that's what we've got here. It's just a, a nice little uh, bit of protection. They make more expensive ones. This one, this one was under $30, and I'll pop up the Amazon um, picture. I don't do links or monetize, but um, when they send me something like this, uh, I do have to put the paid promotion at the beginning, but beyond that, I'm just doing some Instagrams and some videos, but um, I don't do commissions and things like that. So there you go. Not much of this video, but um, I think you'll agree, uh, you saw some of the samples of those lights. It'll be a handy thing to have for sure. And thanks for watching.